What is up, guys? Floodmine14. In the uh, last episode, we uh, went over here to uh, Domino Station to, uh, yeah, just, uh, you know, check out a few of the duels, see who, uh, if we could get some new cards and stuff. And uh, we actually got a, you know, I, I call it solid for early here in the game card, uh, Melting Red Shadow. So in this episode, we're just going to head back and uh, see about uh, dueling uh, one or two more people. So, uh, yeah, we already took on this guy, I'm pretty sure. Uh, right, 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 right. And we already took on that guy over there, kind of with the mole haircut. So let's take on, or see if this guy, this guy might not want to duel, who knows. Everyone looks so tough. Hmm. I'm not sure if I can last until the end. Huh. Yeah, worried about uh, finishing prematurely, huh? That's okay, buddy. I mean, everyone does. <laughs> ah, but you don't look so tough. I think I can beat you. Oh. All right, let's see. Let's see, buddy. Let's play. Let's play. Uh, by the way, yeah, demonetized. Demonetized Josh for that last show. <laughs> I, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. These videos aren't monetized. Come on. All right, and we'll go with the dream type. In my turn, get in face down. What you got, bro? Morphing jar, huh? That seems to be pretty common here early on. Um, I do have a tribute monster, Leo gun, and he's Earth, you're Earth. I could go with Doma, Doma or Leo gun. And they're really kind of the same stat-wise. The big question is, do I want to waste Ginnon, or do I want to try getting a uh, Phantom Thief? That's the real question. You know what? I think I will. I'll try Phantom Thief for the tribute, because 900 is just so good for defense, so. All right, what you got, bro? Good, 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 he's defending, okay. All right, that's this basically. I can't lie. <laughs> What's up with me being tongue-tied the last couple episodes? I don't know. Maybe I'm just... You ever get so t excited to do something, you get tongue-tied? I think that's what's going on. You know what? Let's set a face down here. Just to, just, just to bluff him out. Bluff him out with sparks. Yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. Alright. Make him think we've got a trap hole set. Furious Sea King. I think I only have one of this card. But hey, uh, yeah, I ain't complaining. Good to see you every episode, buddy. Uh, let's attack with Leo Gun first. Because we know we can beat this guy. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. Then we'll go with this. Wicked Mirror. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be patient. I'm not gonna attack with uh, Ginnon. We'll probably tribute him next turn, though. Okay. Alright, so... Let's... Let's just attack. Okay, okay. Because we know, you know, he didn't have the uh, super effective type on us. Okay, and we'll tribute our second monster out here, Doma. Alright. Okay. Leo gun kill. Massive roar attack. Alright, your turn, bro. What you got? You got nothing, son. Alright, alright. Oops. So far, so good. Mooka Mooka. Let's play that a couple times. I wouldn't be surprised if uh, we win a uh, Mooka Mooka for him. So, seems to be a card he's. Oh, 50! You have 50 life points? Now you shall feel the wrath of the Almighty Sparks card. Go! Grant me victory! <laughs> Oh, man, we finished this guy off with sparks. Yes, yes, guys, it happened once in this LP. And we get three capacity. Uh, mechanical spider. Okay, yeah, we've already got a couple of this, so... All right. Thank you. Ha, how can I lose to someone like you? What's wrong with me, bro? Whatever, man. Okay, so I don't think we've dueled this guy. What's up? Hey. What a motley crew of pathetic duelists. Oh, Fancy word, I like that vernacular, buddy. Why? The tenny hasn't started yet, and we still haven't ordered the Duel Express. But I like your spunk. I accept your challenge. Eh, this guy's got some fancy uh, word salads. But let's see if you've got the dueling to back up the dialogue. All right. Ah, 
Kaminari Kozo, huh? I don't know why he revealed his monster. Like, that's, in my book, like a bad strategy. Like, if you would have kept that face down, you know, I might have assumed it was something weak. Like, let's say, you know, hate hate or something, and just walked right in. You know? Yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Fire Reaper was activated. Uh, oh! Nice, nice, nice effect. Okay, so apparently Fire Reaper has an effect in this game. Also, it's Pyro type. Ah, interesting. Uh, do I have any waters? Any waters? No. Um. Huh, I could defend with. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I should crash with Wing Cleaver because uh, since we're forced, his Pyro type can take us down. So let's make the most of the 700 while we can. Call, good call. And good, he's defending. Okay. So, what do we have here? Buku, huh? Um, I'll tell you what, I really just want to find out what his face down is. So, let's go with our weakest monster and attack it. La La Leon. Okay, okay. Not bad. 600. We can defeat that next turn with uh, Buku. So, okay. I just wanted to know, bro. I just wanted to know. Done more damage to us with Fire Reaper, but he chose not to for some strange reason. So, Morphing Jar. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and get that out and take out. You know what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's, let's do it. <laughs> this guy's not gonna have a trap card. Come on. Yeah. Get a Morphing Jar. Good job. All right, I am my turn. You gonna defend now, buddy? Thank God this guy didn't tribute someone either, because uh, that could have been a bad, but, uh, all right, so let's go with, should I go with Conjure Face Down? No, nah, you know what? Buku, get out here. It's time to turn the page and write my victory. All right, go, Jar Smash. All right. We'll keep getting in defense, you know. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't take down Buku. Maybe we have a type effect in this? Um, oh, it was Hinotama. Okay, okay, okay. We'll take out this one with Morphing Jar. Nice. I, I picked just the right ones to attack because he had Lightning Conjure face down. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, well, we'll get, uh, we'll get Han Hanawa out here. I realize I'll probably... Oh, I set off a trap. Okay, I was getting ready to say, I realize I'll probably, you know, take some damage on his turn, but now I won't because I set off his trap. But I'm kind of glad I wasted that, you know. Okay. Still can't take down Buku. Nice. That's that 50. That 50 coming in clutch. Yeah. Nice. Uh, okay, let's, uh... Let's just go with Conjure in defense mode. Yeah. That sounds good. Alright, I end my turn. What you got, buddy? Ooh, okay. Wind beats Earth. Wind beats Earth. Okay. So, down goes Morphing Jar. Sorry, Morphing Jar. But it's okay. Heart of the cards. We just drew, uh... Wind beats Earth. We just drew Furious Sea King. So... Go! Tidal Wave Attack! Alright. Yeah, you might have destroyed one of my 800 monsters, but I drew another one, so ha! Alright. We can draw some tribute monsters here. We can speed this up a bit. Ooh, Little Chimera. Too bad. Okay, and Little Chimera in this game is wind. Interesting, because normally it's a, uh... Normally this is fire type, right? Well, it's, uh, yeah, fire attribute in the uh, regular game, so that's interesting that they gave it wind typing in this game. All right, turn the page. <laughs> uh, let's just go with... Let's go with Hanawa, see if he has another uh, trap. Okay, no, okay. All right, I'll definitely go back home and heal after this one. So we have taken some damage, so... All right, all right. This guy seems to fancy the uh, wind types, so... 
Final Destiny. No, thank you. We'll go with uh, Weather Control. Okay. Time to turn the page. All right. Tidal Wave. Down four. All right, I end my turn. That's right, defense mode, bro. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, let's go with Buku. Nice, 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 nice. All right. Rain shower. Turn the tide, Furious Sea King. It's down to 1,700. Um, well, I can't tribute anything. So, and I can't win either. I guess we'll just set this. And we'll pass. Okay. Alrighty, looks like we got this one wrapped up. Let's turn the page. Ooh, that 50. Buku, clutch, buku. Alright. There we go. And let's finish him off with a little static shockwave. Alright, nice duel, nice duel. And uh, capacity increased by three. Good, good, good. Uh, Droll Bird. Yeah, this guy did play a lot of wind cards, so a curious bird that has a large, flat, and broad beak. Hmm. I'm saving my real strategies for the tournament. Ah, right, right, right. Okay. Uh, oh, okay, he's still saying that. I think that's everyone here. Let me see. So there's Super Saiyan Haircut. Yeah, this guy we fought this episode. That guy. Yeah, there's uh, the... Uh, Bowl cut. Okay, okay. That's everyone on this screen, so yeah, let's go save. And then we'll try to duel some people on the next screen. Uh, if we can, if we can. If we can't, then we can. Uh, Drollbird, by the way, does have a solid attack stat. So let me fix my deck first here. Uh, deck. Let's see... Can I sort this by... Type. Yeah, type, type. Yeah. Who has wind? Uh... I don't think I have many wins, actually. Um, okay, let's go by a tech stat then. Uh, Jinzo, two Jinzos. Okay, I think we can get rid of one of these, unless there's something weaker. Mm, good defense. Um, hmm. Okay, okay, yeah, we'll get rid of a Jinzo, number seven. And we'll put in the uh, Drober because it, it does have a slightly better stats. Where art thou, Jinzo? Oh, I skipped it. Uh, oops, I, went, I, I was kind of talking and not paying attention. Uh, Jinzo. Okay, there we, go, there we go. Add the trunk. And we'll go over here to the trunk. Sort by attack. There we go. And we'll go down to the 600s. Uh, 600. There's that drill bird. Okay, yeah. Come on into the deck, buddy. There we go. And now we'll save here. Heal our life points. Yes. All right, there we go. Okay, so um, now let's go on back. And let's uh, see who else we can do. All right. Uh, before we do go on to the next screen, I think I am going to grab a drink here real quick. Just, uh... Very good, very good. Alright, let's go. Uh, oh wait, did we talk to the train driver? I think we did. Uh, right, right, right. Very crowded. Okay, can you do it? Uh, I'm on duty. Oh, oh, b b but I did want to give this game a try. Ah, I'm glad I thought to talk to this guy. Nice. Let's duel. All right, let's duel, train man. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Hmm. It's Floodmon 14's turn. Okay, good start, good start. Okay, so we'll go with uh, Conjure. I'm actually not going to set Eat a Bagoon because... I don't want it to trigger, uh, I don't think. <laughs> Super effective against your Zarya gun, buddy. 
Ooh, that's some rotten luck, train driver. All right. Now we'll set E to begin. Okay, and let's go with, uh, Thunder Kid. Drugs attack. Static shockwave. Or should I say thunder shock? Yeah, thunder shock. What you got, bro? You got nothing. Ooh, tribute monster, huh? Sounds good to me. We've got a card with uh, good defense. Not too good of attack, so tribute. Alright, I summon Doma, the Angel of Silence. Nice. Is this guy only packing aquas? If so, that's pretty lucky that we drew one, two, three thunders <laughs> to start. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know what he's got, but that is pretty lucky, you know. All right, and also, it's pretty lucky to draw Kaminari Kazuo base, you know, period. Because 700 is, you know, pretty solid for this stage. Let's go with Buku. Ah, another Aqua. Wow. Okay, okay. Well, I don't know if this guy's got all Aquas, but uh, this could be an easy guy to farm for uh, cards if you just pack a bunch of Lightnings in your deck, apparently. So, yeah, there you go. Good to know. Good to know. All right. So, let's just turn the page. Nice. All right, what did we draw? Okay, we didn't draw like a tribute monster or anything. So we'll go with Thunder Shock. And I guess we'll just summon another coming in Nari Kozuo. Alright. I am my turn. Uh ooh, you set off my Edabagoon. Frog the Jam. Uh, not a bad monster. Too bad, but I had a trap card. Eh. Alright, Doma. Go finish him off. Lightning staff attack. Alright, and we defeat the uh, train man. Hunter Domino. Sorry gun. Hmm. Not a bad aqua, honestly. 600, uh, 700? Hulking monster with pincers that evolved from a crayfish. It aims for its opponent's neck with its large pincers. Very good. I quite enjoyed that. Ah. Uh, okay, he's back to saying the same thing. All right. Very good, very good. So I think we'll edit the deck here. Let's go to the deck. Um, let's see. So let's uh, look for our aquas. So I think we've got some weaker ones in the deck, uh, like Starboy in particular, uh, that we can swap out. Yeah, Aqua for Aqua, that sounds like a good idea. Yes, Starboy's at 550. Um, so let's add, uh, oh wow, we got three in the deck? Okay, yeah. Let's, well, let's see if I have any weaker Aquas. Okay, no, 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 no. All right, Starboy, you're out. And we'll go to the trunk and add in Zari Gun. Okay, sort by attack. 600 it had, right? I'm pretty sure. There it is, there it is. All right, come on in, buddy. Move to deck. There we go. All right, so there we go. Uh, should I go back and save? No, 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 in the interest of time, you know, just in case I do, because if you do lose, it is, you know, you do lose uh, your anti-card, I guess, so. But in the interest of time, we'll just go for number one here. There we go. Okay, and I think we've defeated everyone on screen here. Let me just double check. Um, does this guy just walk through me? That was weird. I think we have. Okay, okay. So let's move on up to the next screen. There may be some dialogue. Joe, no. Joey, Joey, are you okay? <laughs> what was he doing there? Uh, wait, what? Uh, I can't walk up? Oh. Um, wait, where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to go this way? Oh! Oh, right, right, right. This is where we got stuck last time. Okay, okay. Uh, maybe I should save before I do this. Hmm. Probably a good call. That's like main story stuff right there. So, okay. Yeah. I actually will go back and save. Good to know, good to know. I thought there were two screens up there, but uh, I guess not. I guess that takes care of everyone before the train so there we go yeah heal my life points please okay all right and let's go back all right back 
to Domino Station. Let's do it. Huh. Yeah, I guess you can't go up here. Okay, okay. Yeah, because I, I actually thought, like, there was another screen up here, mainly because the NPCs were, like, walking past here and then, like, you know, coming back. So, uh, anyway, I guess let's go over... Would you move, bro? I think this guy's in our way, right? Yeah, this guy's in our way. Yeah, 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 I need you to move, bro. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, okay. Uh, can I duel you? Hello. Hello. Talk to me. Duel train stopping at the Egyptian exhibition, right? Right. You want a duel, bro? Huh. Take me lightly and suffer the consequences. Ho ho! Some big talk, buddy. Can you back it up? We'll duel once the train pulls out. Ah, ah, ah scared, huh? Alright. Let's talk to this guy. We haven't even moved yet. Hold your horses. Oh, okay. So, what about you? The train is bound for the Egyptian exhibition. We'll be departing shortly. Why not board now and spend some time dueling? Indeed. Uh, okay. This guy will not duel you, so... Uh, what about you? Will you duel? Just making sure. Welcome aboard the Duel Express. We'll be leaving sh very shortly. <laughs> Forward. All clear. <laughs> Rear, all clear. All clear for Dolly. Dolly Express is good to go. Over. I'm going to give it my best shot. Yeah. Our Dolly Express is on the go. Over. All right, guys, and we're back to the story. So last time I got stuck here, but I think it's pretty obvious that you're supposed to duel. Uh, these two guys, I'm pretty sure. So, uh, yep, okay. Without further ado, adieu, let's do. Think you can beat me? Yeah, buddy, time to back it up. You were talking all that smack earlier. All right, it's my turn. Oh, he went first, okay, okay. Let's do this. Um, I guess we'll go with Wing Cleaver and attack. <gasps> he had a pyro, oh no. Oh, we had another one, okay. Not to worry, though. We've got a 700 Defender. I don't think I'll use this yet. Um, but I do want to make sure I don't play uh, anything with the Force. Yeah, like, I don't want to Tribute Summon for Peacock. That would be bad. That would be bad, so. Okay, what you got, bro? Right, right. Other one super effective? No. Good, good. All right, well, um... Uh, Could tribute now. No, no, no. Let's go with the uh, Kaminari Kozuro. Okay. And I'll end my turn. This guy's been packing the fire so far, so. Okay, okay. Alright, maybe now we'll go for Leogan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Melting Red Shadow. Okay. So something I could do here just to clear him out is to go for Beckon. Um, I think what I'm going to do, though, I'm going to tribute this. We're actually going to go for Leogan here. And since I know it's safe to clear this out, I'll clear that out. And we'll end the turn there. I'm going to save uh, Beckon in case he gets a uh, type effectiveness, you know. I think that's the best call. Uh, get in. Nice, nice. Another good defender. Uh, let's attack this one. Candle of Fate. Good, good, good. Glad I didn't play Peacock yet. And Melting Red Shadow. Okay. So, yeah, this guy's got pretty good... Um, I would say 700 is pretty good at this stage of the game. So, if your deck's not uh, good at getting around, you know, 700 or more yet, uh, yeah, definitely... Do what I did and grind against the early game opponents to get some better cards. So, uh, uh, let's see. I think now we'll try to trip him again. I summon Peacock in attack mode. Client's Roar. Ha, it's time for the main event. Eh, eh, see what I did there? Eh. Alright, time to ruffle your feathers. Okay, I end my turn. Alright. What you got, bro? Pyro? No. 
Well, this duel's over, buddy. I activate Beckon to the Darkness. Now, your monster's destroyed. Go, main events. Thundershock. And let's ruffle those feathers. All right, we were able to turn that one around. Good draw, good draw, good draw on that one. All right, so our deck capacity increased by one. And what? This guy gave us Meteor Freaking Dragon. Uh, awesome. A dragon that came out of the outer reaches of space. It fell to the earth with meteors. Holy crap. You're a lot tougher than you look. Um, yeah, I don't know if we can duel this guy again. But, uh, let me, uh, let me, uh, just, uh, just, uh, just gonna, just gonna use a feature on my Soldier Boy game console, though. Holy crap, this guy gave us freaking Meteor Dragon, bro. Um, yeah, that guy might be worth dueling again, uh, or like a couple times. Because I think after this event's over... I don't think you can duel either of these two anymore, so, uh, holy smokes. Um, and I'm not sure which one I fought, the guy in the blue or the guy in the white. Um, but, uh, yeah, let's check out that card he gave us. So, if we go to, I doubt we can put it in our deck, but, yeah, if we go over here, let's sort by attack. Yeah, Meteor Dragon, pretty good. Um... Let's see. Let me try to take out Star Starboy. I mean, I doubt I have the capacity to fit that card in, but uh, add that to Trunk. And Meteor Dragon, huh? Uh, attack points. Yeah, here it is, Meteor Dragon. Wow. Uh, can I actually put this in my deck? Uh, it costs us 86. Move to deck. Oh, I can, wow. Hmm. Okay. Sweet. All right. Great card. Great card. Um, and to be quite frank, that's like one of the best cards we've gotten so far in this LP. So, yeah. And I'm not sure which guy I dueled. Like I said, the guy in the white or the guy in the blue. But uh, I'm actually going to end things here. And uh, believe it or not, yeah, next episode, we're going to duel him again. And uh, if he keeps dropping good cards like that, I'll probably duel him a few times just to kind of farm good cards off of him. And, uh, you know, if not, you know, if he starts dropping, you know, low stuff that we've seen, like, you know, Hanawa, <laughs> then we'll, we'll move on. But, uh, yeah, a card like that's too good to ignore. So, uh, all right. Thanks for joining me in these episodes, guys. Uh, that's going to do it for this one. And I'll see you all next time. All right. Have a good day.